down. Are you seeing this? Bro, my heart just sank, dude. Shalom, shalom, all praises, honor, and glory. It goes to Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim Rakakradash. Double honors to the apostles, double honors to the elders of Great Millstone, Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai. Uh, Bracket thumb to the hopeful elect. Shalom, shalom. Today's video is going to be entitled The Salvation is Being Seen Daily. The elites are worried. And uh, this is just a response, you know, to the not only to the video I posted yesterday going into the you know the angels that were being being followed by Esau in that in, in those fighter jets but just you know the the current uh, status of what the world calls UFOs in general you understand because you know the true the true understanding of these vehicles you know they're not they're not green men from Mars you know, it ain't it ain't fucking Marvin the Martian in there. It ain't it ain't extraterrestrial beings from you know a galaxy far far away like Star Wars. You know, we understand you know through the Bible that you know the vehicles that that you consider UFOs in the sky are really the angels angels of God. You know, they they've been seen in accounts of Genesis. Uh. Not Genesis, but Exodus specifically. Exodus, they've been seen in the uh, in accounts in 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 the in, in in the books of the kings, and also Zechariah and Ezekiel. They also have seen these things. You know, if you want to, you know, know more, hey, get into the Great Millstone videos. But here today, 2023, you know, it's gotten to the point where the government can no longer deny these instances they can't deny that that these vehicles are flying flying uh throughout united states airspace doing whatever the hell they want man they pull up over military bases they pull up over civilian civilian areas you know what i'm saying they they flying high in the sky and they and they you know they flying as, as low as they as low as they want man because in Amos, it says the eyes of the Lord are upon the sinful kingdom. You know, really the eyes of the Lord are, are, are his angels. So, you know, the one you call, the one you call uh, God, real name Yahweh, and his son, uh, Jesus, real name is Yahweh Shai. He had, he had, they are deploying these angels to, to, to monitor the wicked activity that's going on in the world. They also monitor the wars. You know, a lot of a lot of uh, a lot of war veterans. Uh, there's been a lot of accounts by saying that they've seen what you call UFOs on 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 the battlefields, not only in recent history but history in the past. You see, they have special interests, more specifically in America. You know, there's that map that shows all the latest. All the latest uh, UFO sightings in the past decade, and a majority of them are over the land of America because this is where God's chosen people predominantly are, man. So you see these vehicles having having free reign in the earth. You know, when you have the true understanding, you you should be excited, you should be happy, because that's going to be the salvation of of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah's chosen people. But if you're wicked, if you know that all you did was uh 
push cancer into the earth if you know that all you've done was 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 push evil into the to the earth you've been covetous you've been greedy you know you've done all type of rituals and sacrifices you should be worried you should be worried because these are something that that the military can't control the so-called white man can't control you can't you can't shoot them down as you know no matter how many how many times now how many times that that the white man has said that they have done so already you can't do it man you see so when you when when you have when you when you have a man that being the so-called white man who has who has you know essentially you know destroyed everything in his past for the past 100 years when he's finally faced with that one thing that that he can't overcome hey he gets nervous man he gets nervous that's why i want to you know before i want to get into the precepts i want to read this article from business insider it says see inside the luxury bunkers where the super rich reportedly plan to save themselves from a future apocalypse a few footnotes on the article it says tech billionaires are prepping for doomsday and buying luxury bunkers douglas rushkoff talked to five of the world's richest men about how to prepare for an apocalypse companies like vivos and rising s offer luxury shelters with amenities like pools and horse stables you see indeed we're, we're talking about big 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 bees man billions are going going into these things man not only to provide themselves you know shelter from from the coming destruction and calamity upon earth but to also give them luxuries you see these people don't don't deserve luxuries all the all the millions even billions of people that have died that have died at their hands they know that that there is evil coming towards them that's why they're trying to offset or to avoid this judgment because being honest man if 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 you if you wasn't if you wasn't a if you wasn't a wicked motherfucker you don't have no reason to worry about chariots you don't have no reason to worry about the one the one the world calls jesus returning real name yahweh shot you don't have no reason if you ain't wicked you see but you know, if you if if, if you if you from with a stock of the most evil people of the planet Earth, and all you've done is push evil, hey, guess what, man? Hey, you you should probably uh, <laughs> you should probably lay low. <laughs> hey, brothers, know that know that song by uh, by Snoop Dogg. <laughs> he better lay low. <laughs> That's one of my favorites, man, Nate Dogg. But you know, hey, man, the so-called white man, he he trying to lay low. That's why it says business insiders, tech billionaires are building uh, luxury doomsday bunkers. It says, it said Rushkoff said he was repeatedly asked about ways to survive climate change or evil or, or societal collapse as the executives detailed their plans to build underground bunkers and avoid what they call the event. You see, quote unquote, the event. It said the event that was their euphemism for the environmental collapse, social unrest, nuclear explosion, solar storm, unstoppable virus, or malicious computer hack that takes everything down. And you know what? Through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bashim Yashah, all these things are going to be happening. You know, top it off with, with the nuclear missile drop at the end. You see? But guess what? the salvation is being seen daily man as i said in previous videos there's there's more there's more thermonuclear missile sightings or not thermonuclear missile i'm thinking of that <laughs> but there's been more ufo or quote unquote or you know chariot sightings you know pretty much these past two years than than anything that's come out and the government themselves even acknowledge that that these things exist these things are flying in united United States airspace and they have they have no way to deter it. They have no way to counteract. See what I'm saying? That's why they they push out these false uh these re these false reports saying that saying that they have uh they have shot these things down. You know what I'm saying? These things have crash landed to make you people think that they have a chance when really they know that they don't, man. 
didn't didn't that senator come out two weeks ago and said that said that these vehicles will, can can easily turn us into charcoal man but let's get there <laughs> this this is luke chapter 21 verse 25 and there shall be signs in the sun and in the moon and in the stars and upon the earth distress of nations with perplexity when you look up that word perplexity that goes into great confusion you know and that's that's what a lot of these a lot of these heathen nations including these so-called white people are experiencing when they when they see these objects in the sky you know they're they're changing different colors they're moving directions they're disappearing re they're disappearing reappearing see what i'm saying that's 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 great perplexity <laughs> 